looking at the PHET circuit simulations and I've set up two circuits which is very similar to question one and two a one a and b on page 18 where there are batteries in series and batteries in parallel and I can change the value of the battery by just clicking on the battery and you see the voltage at the bottom so it's one volt three volts and this one's two volts and if I want to measure the voltage across the batteries, all that I have to do is get the voltmeter and there's your voltage, okay? And you put the voltmeter back like that. And if I needed to measure the current in the circuit, you just connect in a meter like this and you can get the current and that's a meter back. Now what happens when batteries are in parallel? So this one's nine volts and that one's nine volts as well. So when you have two batteries in parallel, you don't add their voltages. It's the same. It's nine volts. And if you want to measure the voltage across across the lamp, um, that's nine volt. It should be nine volts. Okay. Put that back. Okay. And then if you want to measure the current in the circuit, you just put the ammeter like this and you can get the current. And what you could do is you can configure circuits um, similar to what is in the question sheet on page 18 and try those out to see if what you got theoretically matches what you do when you connect these circuits. Um, so these are the, the flow of electrons, but you have conventional current going from positive to negative. So this shows you electron flow, conventional current, and if you need values, so these are your values, so it's all given okay and then you can change the resistance of the lamp um, by just sliding that and getting more or less and instead of a lamp you can put resistor it doesn't matter so if i just take the lamp off and then i have a resistor in its place so you've got a 10 ohm resistor and you similar you get similar readings but it's nice with the lamp because you can see it glow doesn't matter what it is lamps have got wires in them that have got resistance